Hello, it is the Kiwi Kink, and I'm here once again playing a little bit of Hitman, and we have a new elusive target. And this bad boy must come to a bad end, so let's dive into the briefing and find out why. Good afternoon, 47. Your target is media personality Bartholomew Argus. The charismatic musician-turned-film star is at the epicenter of a drugs and weapons investigation in the UK and the subject of an Interpol arrest order. The target has gone underground, leaving his former business partner, an infamous London gangster, Tommy the Hammer Stokes, to take the blame. We have learned that the target is lying low in Sapienza as a guest of Dino Bosco and this represents an ideal window of opportunity to engage. The clock is ticking, 47. Good luck. Okay, so let's dive in and see what chaos we can perform. Now, this one's a little different, as it's set on the Sapiens a bonus mission rather than the main map. Um, all the other elusive targets have happened on the main map, which makes sense since everyone has them, but I guess because they're coming towards the end, they've decided that well, everyone who's going to get the bonus Good chapters evening, is going to get them, so Intercepts why not? Intercepts have placed members of the target's entourage in Sapienza, and this may lead you to the target himself. The chaos of Bosco's epic film production will, no doubt, provide cover for your infiltration, and I'm sure number of opportunities to engage him. Good hunting, 47. Okay, stay put. Take a look. Oh, okay. Hey, come out whoever you are. Yeah, thank you. Ah, screw this. Okay. Chaos created. Now, since I know that's the dude's cut. This will hopefully draw out our target. Hey, you're not safe. Get out of here. So this will hopefully draw out our target. Back to work, but keep those eyes open. We just need to wait for him to arrive. Hopefully everyone calm down. And there he is. So, he will go over and he will have a conversation. Lovely day. You bloody morons! You had one job, one bloody job, and you fuck it up, my wankers! I'm sorry, sir. I assure you we'll review the security procedures to make sure nothing like this ever happens again. Oh, brilliant! You'll review the security procedures, will ya? What a load of wank, you useless twat! How's that gonna fix my car? Calm down. We'll talk to Bosco's people and get a mechanic sent out. It's just a car, right? Just a car? Are you taking a piss or what? Ah, oh, I'll tell you what. Forget about it. Sod it. I'm too knackered to even deal with this right now. Come on. Mr. Argus. Very British. Mr. Argus, it's me. Hey there. All right. Who are you again? I'm your biggest fan, remember? I sent you those funny pictures of my cat. <laughs> I guess some of them were a little, I don't know, risque, but hey, I, I got carried away. Are you taking the piss, mate? Stokes sent you, didn't he? What? Who? Oh, stop talking bollocks, you plonker. I know how Stokes thinks. 
We're from the same manor. Honestly, I think he's just a crazy fan. <laughs> One of the few crazy fans you have left. What was that? Ah, nothing. I'm just saying this is some kind of mistake. He's got nothing to do with Stokes. Mistake my ass. I smell trouble all over this little shit. You heard the man. Now get your bloody ass out of here. This area's for VIPs only, okay? And don't forget your crazy cat pictures or whatever it is you were on about. Wow. No need for that tone of voice, mister. I know when I'm not wanted. Jerk. Uh, see you later, Mr. Argus. Yeah, whatever, mate. Who the fuck was that bloke? That fucking Joey Deacon just came out of bloody nowhere. Jesus. You're trying to get me buried six feet under. You're my bloody agent. Don't let Stokes get to you, okay? We got your back. Oh, yeah, right. Look what happened to my fucking wheels. Yeah, I had nothing to do with that. So... No. There are better ways to get on the internet. And push. Target down. Goodbye, target. The money has been wired to your account. Sorry. Gotta go. I hear there's been a small accident on set. Tee hee hee. Okay. Hey there. Hey. Uh, so that was fun. Okay, now let's just move out of here before any alarms are raised. But hey, you know, we should be good. Try not to get filmed. Uh, I wish there was a easier exit to get to on this level. Um, but the only other exit requires a couple of steps. But well, that's okay, I get to run through the scenic um, village and show off my lovely winter coat. Which I'm wearing in Sunny Sapienza for some reason. Anyway, let's go! Mission accomplished. Silent assassin, ha ha ha. Yeah. Yep, I'm happy with that. Anyway, I am the Kiwi Kink, and I will see you next time.